to uh, AM News. Good morning, Alicia. And All right. Members of the New Year. Thank you. Thank you so much, France. Now, tomorrow, Noom will meet with the striking members at Northern before proceeding to hold another meeting with employees in the afternoon. Any hope of a breakthrough in those meetings, France? Well, we're hoping uh, there should be a breakthrough, uh, mm -hmm. depending really on. Um, how members react to what has been tabled by the company. Mm -hmm. We have urged the company uh, to show urgency on this matter mm -hmm. because it has been more than 10 weeks, actually, it's the 11th yeah. week now. And uh, these members have been so disciplined. Mm -hmm. We really appreciate the, how they have handled the strike. There's been no single intimidation or violence, but they were just committed to get what they deserve. Mm, mm, mm. Now, France, numerous voice concerns about the bloodshed seen in the mining sectors and industry in South Africa. What do you think could be the underlying causes of these strikes? Look, uh, the, in the main, this um, unprotected strike mm -hmm. are the ones which uh, tend to deliver violence and intimidation. Mm -hmm. You could see that it is in, informed by lack of support mm -hmm. and therefore people who have to use violence, vig vigilantism basically, to coerce workers to participate in a strike which they have no support. Mm -hmm. Where there's a strike which is protected, you can see how NUM has done it. Not a single bloodshed mm -hmm. in Northern, a platinum strike, in the gold mine strike, in the coal mine strike, which we had mm -hmm. um, uh, last year. So we're urging all mine workers, when they exercise their right uh, to strike, it should be in such a manner that it does not uh, tamper with others' rights, mm. nor take away uh, someone's life. Mm, mm, mm. Very, very true there, uh, France. Now, you've also called for a speedier process at the Falum Commission um, so that uh, to ensure justice for the victims of Marikan. Um, what, in your view, will be a fair compensation for the miners? This has been dragging so long, as you know, that uh, the Falum Commission is supposed to have taken only five months. Yes. Over and above 34 people which have been killed by the police, mm -hmm. there is more than 34 which has been killed by other uh, man workers. There has been some arrests. Uh, so the sooner this matter is winded up, at least where it can give us fundamental solutions uh, to prevent reoccurrence. Mm -hmm. But on the prosecution side, that it must take its course. So people who have killed others, they must be prosecuted and be arrested. Mm, mm, mm. Now, France, you've openly stated that uh, former members who left the union are more than welcome to come back. Which members are these that you're referring to? Well, we're seeing members coming back to their home. Mm -hmm. We are still making an open invitation. Um, and you have here to stay, as our youth say, uh, and relax in China and yeah, is here to stay. Mm -hmm. This is a tested union of over 30 years and we have done things always according to the rule mm -hmm. and they will find us uh, waiting for them and continue to service and improve uh, their condition of service and their living condition in the mining industry. Mm, mm, mm. Is this partly why we're seeing unprecedented move Noom advertising its work via platform? We have been uh, communicating with our members mm -hmm. in various forms, yes. and they've urged us to use the social media, um, general uh, media, uh, to talk to them. Mm -hmm. um, we've got 54% of our membership are youth, mm -hmm. and they want to see some of this um, uh, communication method mm -hmm. which we are applying, and we're very pleased with the response, as well as gender. By the way, Alicia, you must be pleased to know that mm -hmm. we have about 12% uh, members who are women, wow. and they're doing very well in the industry. All right. Now, Franz, uh, what would you say to the, there's been rumor of uh, an establishment of a new union that com could come into light. What, what problems could that pose for, for NUM? Well, the problem is not necessarily about NUM. Mm -hmm. The more workers divide themselves in one sector, they are actually uh, weakening their cause. They are weakening a worker struggle. Mm -hmm. So the splinter unions are not helping the cause of the workers, mm -hmm. but individual leaders who are benefiting out of that exercise. Mm -hmm. Our call is one uh, union, one industry, uh, united we bargain, divided we beg. Mm. But many would argue, France, that the strike has, has gone on now for, for about 10 weeks and there's still no end and, and resolution to that. But how, what other ways are you, are you making sure that you're pushing this agenda forward? I mean, it is January. People would like to, to, to start the working year with a full salary at the end of the yes, month. Yes, indeed. Uh, unfortunately, the strike had to um, come over Christmas as well. Mm -hmm. But this is how quality bargaining um, happens. Mm -hmm. uh, We're hoping to strike a deal of a two-year, um, which uh, members should be happy uh, for, for what uh, could be achieved out tell of the struggle. Your, yes, tell us about everything that you're looking for for, for for your members that you're actually notioning them for, uh, France.
Well, we are looking at uh, for improvement in living um, um, conditions, uh, conditions yeah. mm -hmm. uh, as well as a living out allowance, mm -hmm. which allows for the workers who are staying um, in their accommodation to get some money to rent or uh, buy a property. Mm -hmm. We're looking at uh, medical aid support, um, service increment. Mm -hmm. As you work more years, you must actually accumulate some kind of increment mm -hmm. uh, every year. Mm -hmm. A better wage, as well as looking at those who are uh, in a core production, mm -hmm. getting slightly better than those who are working like yourself, Alicia, Absolutely. in offices. <laughs> Thank you so much, uh, France, yeah, for welcome. coming and, and, and talking to us today. Well, that was uh, NUM General Secretary, France Baleni, talking to us about the latest developments, of course, with NUM. Of course, that's all we have.